Hey everybody, it's Rob from RhythmicVocabularies.com here for 180Drums.com to talk to you about some stickings and phrasing. Today we're going to be using a 5-5-3-3 five, five, three, three sequence to create one bar of 16th notes. So what do I mean by 5-5-3-3? Five, five, three, three? Real simple, we're going to be using a sticking pattern that is 5 beats long, followed by another one that's 5 beats long, followed by two three note sticking patterns. So the basic sticking pattern that we're going to start with is a right, left, left, right, right, left, right, right, left, left, right, left, left, right, left, left. On the snare drum, let's hear what it sounds like. That's your basic sticking pattern. I like this stuff because it allows me to build control and facility, but also something that I can bring to the kit. It's a compound sticking. We have singles, we have doubles, but there are accents built in. So let's start moving this around the drum set. All that I'm going to do at first is just move the singles, right hand to the floor tom, left hand singles to the rack tom. All the doubles are going to stay on the snare drum. Here it is. Next step, we leave the singles on the snare drum, we move the doubles. Once you have that down, it's time to just start experimenting on the drum set. Keep the same sticking pattern, maybe set it up with one bar of time followed by a one bar fill. Let's see what that sounds like. Next up, we have a different five note sticking pattern. Now we're going to move to right, left, right, left, left, followed by right, left, right, left, left, and again, right, left, left, right, left, left. Here that is on the snare drum. Again, same thing, move your right hand, uh, move all the right hand singles, move the left hand doubles and singles. Play around with it, have fun. The next way I want to use this is what's called linear. Or what linear means is no two notes, no two limbs stack on top of one another. So this is going to be right, left, right, left, bass drum, right, left, right, left, bass drum, right, left, bass drum, right, left, bass drum. Here's the basic pattern. Again, we want to move this around the drum kit. I'm just going to play around with it for a second just so you get a sense of what this can sound like. As you can see, this stuff can start to sound really cool when played this way. Again, set it up with one bar of a basic rock or funk groove, followed by one bar of a 16th note fill, two bars of a rock groove, two bars fill, three bars groove, one bar fill. Use it to, as a jumping point for solos, fills, whatever. The next way that I want to use this, I'm going to use the exact same linear pattern, but I'm going to move my right hand to the hi-hat, left hand's gonna stay on the snare drum, and I'm gonna create a really cool halftime funk groove. Let's hear what this sounds like. And now, up to speed. this basic pattern and add some doubles and an additional accent 
to make the groove sound a little more fun. Our basic groove is going to be this. and then up to speed.